This video will give an overview of the Comparative Explorer for the developing human brain. This part of the portal shows the gene expression data from the Brainspan Atlas of the Developing Human Brain, as made available by the Allen Institute for Brain Science. The dataset contains gene expression measurements from 16 brain regions in several stages of development. The Comparative Explorer has one central map and eight maps around it. The small maps each represent a single developmental stage from prenatal early second trimester to adulthood. The central map is based on a combination of all samples. Each point in a map is a gene, and two points are close together if the genes have a similar expression pattern. The central map uses gene expression across anatomical regions and development. Therefore, it captures the spatiotemporal co-expression in the brain. Each individual small map uses only samples within a single developmental stage, so it captures spatial co-expression at a specific point in time. The heat map at the right gives an overview of all the samples that are represented. Each row corresponds to an anatomical sample like the cerebral cortex. Each column is a developmental stage. The colours we see are now those of the Allen Reference Atlas of Brain Anatomy. The gene maps are all linked. If we hover over a map, we highlight a set of 50 genes around the mouse pointer. These 50 genes will then be highlighted in all the other maps as well. The highlighted genes in the small maps can range in colour from blue to red. This reflects the average expression of this gene in the samples of this developmental stage. So the genes that are red in this map have a high average expression in the adolescent brain. At the same time, the heat map shows the average expression pattern of the selected gene set both across the brain and throughout brain development. At the top left of the screen, we find some predefined gene selections. The cell type groups contain marker genes for several brain cell types. These genes have found to be specifically expressed in a given cell type in the mouse brain. These are the oligodendrocyte markers. The central map shows that most of these genes are co-expressed in the dataset. However, when we look at the maps of the prenatal developmental stages, we find that the oligodendrocyte marker genes are spread out. They are not spatially co-expressed at these points in time. We can also see that most of the points are blue, so the genes have a low average expression. At later stages, most marker genes turn red and become clustered, so the genes that are specific to oligodendrocytes become active and spatially co-expressed in the brain. The comparative explorer of the developing human brain can be used to explore these patterns in gene expression across the brain and through time. You can get more help by enabling tooltips and reading the help. Thank you for watching this video and enjoy using the BrainScope portal.